Do you know anything about endangered species? Do you know why some of the animals are listed as endangered species in India? Do you know what are the actual cause behind it? Well, let's have a look. Hello guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Agassi Anthony. And my main purpose to start this channel is to create awareness and to uh, protect wildlife. So uh, those who are new to this channel, please do subscribe and like and also do press the bell icon for the notification. Till then, let's gain some knowledge and let's do something good for the wildlife together. Let's get started. So today we'll be talking about the most endangered species in India and also what are the actual cause behind these animals who are getting extinct. Well, uh, we cannot cover all the animals, but we'll try to cover the most critical ones. So, do you know there are 132 species, including plants and animals, which are listed as critically endangered species in India? And if we don't uh, look into it, these species or these animals will be soon no longer seen in this world. So, the reason to look into it is we humans. We humans are the reason behind these endangerment of the species. So I would say, if you want to listen to your own words, you Anyway, so there are five main causes because of which animals are endangered in India. Well, I would say not only in India, uh, because of these causes, animals are endangered all across the globe. Well, the first cause is poaching. Poaching means animals are hunted down or animals are trapped by humans for their needs. For example, for their skin, for the medicinal purpose, for eating, for trading, and for the royalty purposes as well. Poaching is one of the uh, main cause because of which the animals are getting extinct not only in India but it is all over the world. Well these are the animals uh, which are getting extinct mostly because of poaching. Well the first thing first, Bengal tiger. Bengal tiger is a national animal of India but still this animal is listed as critically endangered species in India. Quite ironic right? Well yes it is. Uh, these animals were hunted down because of the uh, because of the royalty purpose earlier, but then now these animals are hunted down because uh, for the skin, for the medicinal purposes. I mean, their body organs are uh, used for the medicinal purposes, and uh, also for trading purposes as well. These animals are used. Well, the second thing is snow leopard. Snow leopards are one of the most beautiful animals on this planet, and you'll find these animals usually uh, in the Himalayan region. Well, obviously because of that, uh, this animal is known as snow leopard. And you'll find this animal in Pakistan, India, uh, China. Well, these animals are hunted down mainly because of their skin, because their skin are really, really thick and it's really soft with lots of fur on it. So it is used for the various purposes. And also uh, the animal's body organs are used for the medicinal purposes and yeah it is uh, used for the trading purpose as well as usual and for the royalty purpose. But the third thing is Asiatic lion. Asiatic lion is one of the unique animal of India because uh, these animals are comparatively smaller in size with less mane than African lions. But do you know in 20th century these animals were somewhere about 60,000? and now these animals are somewhere about 400 to 500 just imagine just just see the difference and these animals are hunted down because of the same reason skin body organs uh, for royalty purpose for trading <sighs> well the fourth animal is the indian elephants indian elephants are the second largest animal in the world after african elephants no wonder and uh, these elephants are the largest uh, animal in Asia. To identify this animal, if we compare it with African elephants, these animals have much larger or much bigger skull with long trunk and shorter legs. And the legs are really strong, they say. And these animals are hunted down because of the tusks. And these tusks are valuable because it is used for the manufacturing of piano and the organ keys. It is used for the uh, billiard balls. And it is also used for making the airtight seals. And nowadays these tusks are used for uh, making the special electrical appliances. So yeah, animals are killed mainly because of these uh, 
things. Well, the fifth animal which is listed as critically endangered is the Indian Rhino. Well, this one-horned Indian Rhino is killed because of uh, its horn. Do you know these horns are made up of the same material from which our nails and our hair is made up of? Uh, the protein name is keratin. Well, I don't understand then why these animals are killed. In Chinese tradition, these horns are used for medicinal purposes to cure uh, fever and also to treat hangovers. And also these Chinese use these horns for a status symbol for success and wealth. Well, the sixth animal is pangolins. 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 How do you pronounce it? Pangolins. Anyway, I'll prefer calling it pangolins. Yeah, so this pangolins are one of the critically endangered species in India because these animals are usually uh, used for the medicinal purposes because these animals have shells on their body for the defense purpose and uh, these shells are made up of the same protein from which our nails and our hair is made up of and even the uh, rhinos on and the demand for this animal is usually in china because uh, they say this animal's meat also tastes really good well, i don't understand well the seventh animal is a red panda red panda is also known as red cat bear or uh, it is also referred to firefox well uh, these animals are killed because of their skin and uh, it is been killed because uh, it has a really thick fur on it and which is used for making caps and hats well there are lots of animals who are critically endangered but uh, we cannot talk about all the animals as this video will be too long for it uh, do you know anything about any endangered species in India? Well, please do comment below and let me know. And also, uh, if you have any more information about whatever I have said. So, it will be a learning for me as well. So, please do comment. So, let's move on to the second cause, which is habitat degradation. Habitat degradation means the process by which habitat becomes incapable of, you know, uh, incapable of supporting the native species. And what do you think? Who is practicing this process? We humans, as usual. So, uh, the best example is urbanization, deforestation, harvesting fossil fuels, and many more. So, habitat destruction uh, through human activities is mainly for the purpose of harvesting natural resources for industrial production and for urbanization. Well, the third thing is overgrazing. Grazing is an agricultural term where uh, livestock are sent in the grassland to feed on grass so that they can convert it into milk, meat, wool, etc. It is a part of an animal husbandry, but excessive grazing causes damage to the grassland which affects the soil and that leads to desertification. So even this is uh, one of the reason where because of which the animals are getting extinct. So management of agriculture is very much necessary here. The fourth cause is inbreeding. Inbreeding means uh, mating of animals who are closely related. So, uh, and animals are getting extinct because of uh, inbreeding depression, which means the original animal uh, is getting extinct because uh, this inbreeding is happening on a large scale. For example, black buck. Yes, the Salman Khan case. So, this animal is also in the list of critically endangered species. Well, the fifth cause is population fragmentation. Fragmentation of habitat by building roads and cities, which leads to create patches for the animals in that habitat. So because of that, population of animals are also fragmented. And the animals who live together in that habitat also get separated because of this habitat division, which also leads to animals getting extinct. For example, this Corona ka lockdown case. Abhi jo log family se dur rahe hai ya reh bhi rahe hai un pe jo beet raha hai un, unko jaise lag raha hai the problems they are facing that is the exact same thing how animal feels when uh, they are separated from their family and their places well i don't know i could have given any better example than this but uh, please do understand and please think about it because this is how i can relate the problems with you know humans 
बहुत ज्यादा ज्ञान हो गया ना आज वेल दो स्टिल वॉचिंग दिस वीडियो थैंक यू सो मच गाइज आई रियली अप्रिशिएट दैट प्लीज डू सब्सक्राइब लाइक and share this video as much as you can and please do comment as well and let me know what all things i should cover in my next video related to protecting my life and also what all things i should change in my video so that i can uh, connect to the people more and also do watch my video which you can see on your screen right now i've mentioned how to change the mindset of the people towards protecting my life and last but not the least happy easter to you guys and uh, let's fight this covid-19 together stay home stay safe take care and keep spreading love thank you so much guys stay tuned see you soon